Hello, everybody. Happy Wednesday. Wednesday. Welcome back to the channel. Another part of our Skyrim roleplay let's play. Um, trying to catch my breath here. I just came running up the stairs and, uh, well, I had to run down, run back up, run back down, then run back up. So, yeah. <sighs> All right, let me just catch, get my breath. And for those of you who don't know, I suffer with fibromyalgia, so that causes shortness of breath as well and blah, blah, blah. whole bunch of other crap. All right, so let's get into this. Fenoria's story is taking a change, taking a turn for the better, quote unquote. So today it's about getting to really know who Fenoria is. If you've been following her story, then you know she's come from a small village off the border um in the Daggerfall Covenant and she's actually part Redgar, Breton Guard. Her father was a strong Redgar warrior and her mother was a Breton and basically you guys are meeting Brea who is Fenoria. Um so it says, meet Brea, Fenoria's alter ego, quote unquote. Brea is her birth name, but she used to hate it. Now that she is really ready to accept and understand the truth about herself, and she's deciding to honor her parents by accepting her Rhaegar birth name and Dragonborn calling. So, Brea used to like learning about, you know, the things her father was doing he used to teach her how to use a sword and a bow and shield and little things like that and he wanted her to be a great warrior because they didn't have any sons so Brea didn't really want to do all of that she didn't mind learning some of the stuff because she thought it was cool but as she got older she just wanted to do her own thing and decided to go by the name Fenoria and try to learn magic and stuff, which Regars aren't into magic and stuff like that. But now that she's here in Skyrim and learning her destiny and seeing that Skyrim really needs a dragonborn, she decided, okay, I'm going to go back to my birth name because Regars are known as strong warriors. She's go she wants to be that warrior her father always wanted her to be. And what better way to start than going back to her roots, taking on her birth name, going by her birth name, living up to her birth name, and by truly accepting her dragonborn calling. So she's like, look, Skyrim, I'm here. I am Redgar. I am dragonborn. I am a warrior. I am ready. So that's what this is all about. All right, so let's get into it. We are on our way to Fall Creep. I was going to finish Walk Down there, but uh, we'll take River on down there. Brea heard about Fall Creep, and she decided to come check out this little this town. Just from the name of it. She's like, you know, Fall Creep. A guard actually told her about it. She's like, that sounds like a nice place to visit. So, we're gonna go visit Fall Creek and see if any of the locals need help here. Did you see a dog out there? No. 
I seen some bandits and a bear, but no dogs. Oh well. The blacksmith is offering a reward for a dog he saw on the road. I was hoping you'd seen it. I guess I'll stay on the lookout. Of course. Keep your nose clean while you're here, outsider. Shall we ride in? No, let's just walk on in. You come in, see somebody hard at work. You, unless Hi. you intend to bury someone, this isn't the place you're looking for, traveler. Why? Um, what's this about a burial? Well, Falkreath is known for its graveyard, traveler. We've buried more dead than you can imagine. Really? I just finished giving my old war companion Barrett a proper burial by fire. Old Hardhead hated the idea of being lost cold in the ground. Could you deliver the ashes to Runil, the priest of Arkay? He'll know the right blessings to make for Barrett's soul. Of course. I'd be honored to help you. Thank you. Until next time. Try not to judge Falkreath too harshly, visitor. The war has been hard on us. Of course. Hey. It's so good to see you again. We've never met. I've been getting that a lot. <laughs> I'm telling you, I heard it. Howling. Those werewolf tales are true. Alright. Let's have a look around here. Got the blacksmith over here. Hi. Did you see a hound on the road? Fine, strong creature that's been wandering near town. No, I'm sorry. The guard at the gate mentioned a dog, but I didn't see no dog. There's one out on the road. I can't afford to chase him down, but I could use a fierce, loyal beast to keep me company. If you were willing to retrieve him for me, I'd give you some fresh meat to attract him out on the road. Uh... You know, I could be convinced to catch him. I really didn't come here to catch a dog. Oh. It's a smart man to demand something up front for his work. Some gold now and some when I have my dog. Here's the meat. Of course. So, hey. Hey! Steel's good, but loyalty's better. I'm loyal to Dengir first and the Empire second. All right. What do you have for sale? Hmm. Blades, helmets. Pretty much anything to suit your needs. What's going on with this music? Oh, what's this one? Oh, okay. Major destruction. Archery. Major health. Uh. See me at my forge if you need arms or armor. Oh. Only a hearty soul. I like to the armor my days. horse. Of course. Let's go with, um, well, I do wear a lot of steel. Um, some elven armor, I guess. Thanks. Good steel's worth every septum. Remember that. He talks a lot. Guess that's not a bad thing. At least he's friendly, huh? Okay, so I guess that's the end there. Got up there. Let's finish looking around first. Then gear. Corpse light farm. Corpse light. They must really be big on death here, huh? Now where's this wrong nil guy? Uh, find a dog. Oh, yeah, I still gotta go to the Jarl. Jacoda. Current. Ashes. Let's get us a couple of gourd. Get some stew or something. Cabbage. I don't want to take all their stuff. Hmm? 
Oh, this is a uh, nice. Hmm. Oh, over here. Hall of the Dead. Hi. Strangers like you bring war. I've seen enough war. Trust me, I bring peace, not war. The god Arke was once like us, bound to winding mortality. But he willingly gave up this existence that we might better understand the vagaries of life and death. Wait a minute, let me turn this music down because I don't know why it's... It is down. Bring the voice up a little. It is through the ebb and flow of this cosmic tide that we find renewal and in the end peace. May the spirit of Lavinia <laughs> and why are they all staring at me this world and its suffering know the beloved serenity of Aetherius. They're probably wondering and what am I doing day here. Rejoin them in eternity. I was there too. Excuse me. You alright? You look like you might be sick. Oh great. Blasted vampires. Um, I have a delivery from Bad Gear. Ah. Barret's ashes. He was a good man. Not many warriors grow to a fine old age. Thank you for bringing this to me. I'll make sure he gets his rights. Here, for your trouble. Um, so you're a priest of Arke? I am. I came into Arke's light after the Great War. So many died by my hands. My magics. Really? I'm fortunate that Koost and the people of Falkreath have come to accept me as one of their own. Could you do an old elf a favor? I misplaced my journal in a cave I was exploring. I'll pay for its return. Um, no problem. I'll do it. Blessing of RK to you for your help. You think you could cure me? No? So, you tend this graveyard alone? Oh, merciful RK, no. I'm too old and frail, and this graveyard is too large. Kust is my assistant. He helps me tend the headstones and keep our cemetery clean, as befits a place of rest. All right. I'll need to be going now. Nice to meet that you. That journal means a lot to me, if you find it. Of course. Hi. A sad time. Uh, I guess I have cabbage to sell. I'm honest pay for that. honest work. Well, you could take my gourds too. Uh, could use the gold. I'll get some more. Honest pay for honest work. So, is this place always so gloomy? Yes, and I couldn't tell you why. My wife and I think there's some dark magic at work. Or perhaps RK's influence is strong here and he likes to keep it this way. I see. So who died, if you don't mind me asking? Our daughter. What? Our little girl. She hadn't seen her tenth winter. Really? So she was only nine. Who who did this to her? Sinding. Came true as a laborer. Seemed like a decent man. He's stewing in the pit while we figure out what to do with him. If you've got the stomach to look at him. What could drive a man to do something like this? I don't know. That's probably the harshest thing I've ever heard since being in Skyrim so far. How did she die? She was... He ripped her apart. Like a saber cat tears a deer. Oh, Talus. We barely found enough of her to bury. Oh. By the gods. Talus, bless you and your wife. I'm sorry. I just don't understand what kind of man does that. You don't look so good. Are you feeling all right? Um, yeah, I've been getting that a lot. Let's go see if we can find uh, alchemy or... Because I don't want to use this, um... thing here. 
that shrine I don't even know I mean what does RK shrine do um don't suppose you'd enchant my sword that old blade can barely cut butter <laughs> Well, uh, I'm still learning and <laughs> enchanting, but uh, when I get the hang of it, I'll help you out. Uh, River. Goodness gracious. Stay right here. Maybe it's a summon the Dragonborn to High Hrothgar. Such a thing has not happened for hundreds of years. He said <laughs> his blade could barely cut butter. He need to talk to the Jarl about getting a new blade then. For a dragon to attack Kynes Grove. Why? Why there? Is no place safe? Yeah, don't ask me why I opened that. I mean, I don't think this place is gloomy. It, it seemed nice. What we have here. Jarl's long house. Ah, I think this grape concoctions. Jeez, you got corpse light, grave concoctions. What's the name of the other places? Hi. You're someone who can get things done. I like that. So you heard of me, huh? Look, um, why name your store Grave Concoctions? I know, it's a bit strange. Not exactly a name to bring comfort to the sick and ailing who come to buy a poultice or salve. But what you must understand about Falkreath is that our town is defined, for better or worse, by the large and ancient cemetery here. That's why the inn is called Dead Man's Drink, the farm is called Corpse Light is... Farm, and so on. I suppose it's sort of a running joke. <laughs> I see. Um, there aren't many Ragars in Skyrim. What brought you here? Well, my family back in Hammerfell didn't approve of my interest in lethal poisons and death in general. So I left and wandered north. When I found this town with its huge cemetery, I felt right at home. I opened the shop and I've never looked back. This is where I belong. Yeah, I feel like I belong in Skyrim as well. So, um, I need to be going then. Until next time. Of course. She got some good stuff. How much? I don't have a lot of gold, so I'm not gonna purchase nothing. But she might got some ingredients I could use. Yeah, so, uh, let's see. Falkreath's warriors always return, one way or another. It's a nice town. I s don't blame them. What do you got for sale? Take a look. I need some ingredients. I don't think I have ectoplasm. Fire salt for 100 and... Ew, this stuff expensive. High grave and claw tape. Honeycomb. Ice wrap teeth. Bergen set tap root. Oh gosh, those boy salts cost a lot. Well, let's see if I got something I could sell her. Uh, no, not really. Oh, what about... Oh, well, no. Oh! You take dragon bones? Fine. There you go. I don't know where I got all these mammoth tusks from, but... I have some. Now, this food gotta go back home and stuff, so... Until all next right. time. Thank you. from her, especially not now, <laughs> at least. Now, what's this place? Falkreath Barracks. Alright, let's go talk to the Jarl. Let him know that we're in town. And to see if he need any help. So, we gotta find a dog. Find Romeo's journal inside. Dark Shade Cops? Colts? That's all the way over there back by uh Well in between White Run and One Hill. And what's this? The dog, okay. 
Need something? Hello, Jarl. Yes? What is it that you want? My name is Brea, and I'm in town, and I wanted to know... Bolin speaks much about the war and the storm cloaks, but he knows who provides. Of course. I, I was looking for some work. Work? I demand tribute before you can be considered for any real tasks. How about drink? None of that local piss. Real what? Blackbriar mead, fresh from Riften. Okay, um... I'll bring you some mead. You better. I hate people who waste my time. Of course. <laughs> Come and see me again sometime. I might have some use for you. How are you gonna tell us we better bring him <laughs> some? So, what, I gotta go to Riften now? Where could I get a Blackbriar mead from around here that's close by? I'm not traveling all the way to Riften just to provide him with a Blackbriar mead. What is it? Oh, uh, nothing. Uh, I think, where could I get some black fire mead from? Maybe if I search a barrel or, uh... Oh, oh, maybe the, the cook in the inn. Well, the innkeeper, you know? Maybe he might have some. I, I hope, fingers crossed. Please, because I don't want to go way out to Riften. Someone's crunching Gotta keep somebody. my eyes open. Damn dragons could swoop down at any time. Yeah, you got that right. Can we steal from these while he's sitting there? We can. Okay, don't move. Alright, let me see if I can get over here. Legendary City of St. Grator. Okay, yeah, that might be pushing it there. We gonna end up in... Hail companion! Hi! Prison. Oh, look, they got potions in here, but he's they sitting right there. They say Alfred Stormcloak murdered the High King with his voice. Shouted him apart. Let's see if we could get these. Do it like one by one. I'm scared. I don't want that axe. Okay. <laughs> Alright, we got some uh, notes and stuff here. Let's read. The steward will have to sign off on it, but I was thinking we should have the bandit's possession serve as a reward in Luau of Gold. According to the informant, he might be carrying valuables with him. I'll bring it up with the steward when I have her sign the bounty. Besides, the more gold we save on bounty hunters, the more we have for the guard. I still haven't gotten approval for the funds to have Law to fix my shield. At this rate, I might as well just use the lid from my pot. Wow. So one guard out there told us his sword isn't even sharp enough to cut butter. Now there's a guard whose shield sucks so bad he'd rather use a toilet lid. The Jarl isn't taking care of his guard, man. Status, active, capture or kill, high priority, description, male, high elf, age, unknown, Background, a member of the Crimson Dirks, a notorious group of bandits and marauders, originally based in Cyrodiil. Little else is known about the target, although some intelligence suggests he was often used as an information gatherer for the bandits. Operational notes, it was originally thought that an Altmar might attempt to blend into wealthier circles, but according to our informant, he's done the opposite. He stripped his armor and gone native, hunting game in the forest off the Sunderstone Gorge. He should still be considered dangerous, however, and it would be wise to put up a bounty when his identity is confirmed. Hmm. I'll take that. By order of Sigir, 
to all able-bodied men and women of folk creep a wanted being that has been hiding in the forest off of thunderstone gorge posing as a hunter rumor has it that he is accompanied by a fearsome wolf a reward will be offered to anyone who kills him ninja all right what's down here So we're getting some work already. Got a little, a few jobs here. This cell actually. If those rebels think they can bad. best us, they have another thing coming. Of course. I don't even know what rebels you're talking about, but. Oh, it's empty. Oh, leg of goat. We need that. Where's that guard? <laughs> I'm telling you, I heard it. How All right, wait a minute. Give me a second. Tales are true. No, not on the stove, but yeah. I just Oh, that's the one. Okay.
might rather have that than, you know. All right, I'm back. Sorry. Need something? Yeah. Come to gawk at the monster. Well, I don't know what to say, other than I hear, hear you attack the little girl. Believe me, it wasn't anything I ever intended to do. I just lost control. I tried to tell them, but none of them believed me. It's all on account of this blasted ring. What ring? This is the ring of Hersey. I was told it could let me control my transformations. Perhaps it used to, but I'll never know. Hersing didn't care for my taking it and threw a curse on it. I put it on, and the changes just came to me. I could never guess when. It would be at the worst times, like with the little girl. What kind of transformations? I don't suppose there's a point in keeping the secret if I'm going to die in here anyway. I'm sure you've heard of men who shift to beasts under the influence of the moons. I am one of them. A werewolf. It's my secret and my shame. That's why I wanted the ring. It was said to give men like me control. Now, I may look like a man, but I still feel the animal inside of me as strong as ever. Listen, between you and I, I was a beast before. And there's no such thing as controlling it. But there's a way you could cure yourself. You just need a witch's head. I don't know much about her scene. I heard of his name from the companions, but I don't understand why did the ring make you attack the girl still? I had just come into Falkreath. They needed some help work in the mill, and I thought that would be something safe, something I could do. When I saw the little girl, I was just... I could feel it coming on. I could taste her. I needed to hunt. But this pitiful, limited body wasn't meant for hunting. Slow, no claws. Weak, mashing teeth for shoeing cud. I held in my rage as long as I could, but it boiled inside of me. She looked so fragile, helpless prey, and then... I... I feel terrible about what happened about what I did. It would probably be best for everyone if I just went away. Well, that's why you're locked up. So that you can't do that again. What do you plan on doing now? I've been looking for a way to appease Hersing. There is a certain beast in these lands. Large, majestic. It's said that Hersing will commune with whoever slays it. I tracked it into these woods, but then I had my accident with the child. I want to beg his forgiveness, give him back the ring. But while I'm stuck in here, the beast wanders free. Well, I suppose I could take the ring to Hersing. Oh my, you would do this for me? Here, take it. I, I don't want anything to do with this wretched thing anymore. Seek out the beast. He wanders these woods. Bring him down and uh, the Lord of the Hunt should smile on you. I wish Lord you luck. Of the hunt. But you leave here while I still have my skin. Should our paths cross again, I will remember your kindness. Farewell. Farewell, Sending. So in a way, he couldn't help himself, you know? Attacking that... What the... Guards? Can I get in there? Uh, let's get out of here, Marcorio. I'm not getting in trouble. Oh, man. Hey. Trouble? Yes. That guy sending. He, he just turned into a wolf. Don't go in his Got cage, I tell you. Maybe I'm the dragonborn, and I just thought 
Oh. Okay, you want to make fun of, of this? Fine. Fine. Dag on guards. All right, well, let's see what we got. Kill the great beast. Kill is a zero. Kill a zero. Kill the great beast. The dog. What time is it? Uh, let's see. Oh, and the Yara wants some black briar meat. I wanted to get my hands on some myself just to add to my collections, but I don't want to travel way out to Rifton just to get him a bottle of black briar meat. What do he think this is? Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. And who are you? I was Jarl once, but I was encouraged to step down when I took sides with the Stormcloaks. It was an Imperial plot, I tell you. Oh, you like the Stormcloaks. Good on you. So you were Jarl before? Aye, not so long ago. Some will tell you I stepped down on account of my old age. Truth is, I found out about all the Imperial spies crawling around Falkreath. A few well-placed bribes, and they bought themselves some friends. Suddenly, the nobles are calling for a new Jarl. And all the while, their pockets are jingling with the sound of Imperial Septons. They named me Thane. They got my nephew Sidgear in my place. A real friend to Cyrodiil, that one. Hold on, hold on. So are you guys all related? We got that gear, your Din gear, Sid gear. Is there any other gears I need to know about around here? No? Yes? Anyway, so there's a plot against you, huh? Well, not against me, against all of Falkreath. Those Imperial this bastards are spying on every one of us. Last night, I saw Lord the Blacksmith writing a letter. <laughs> Probably sending word to Solitude and General Tullius. Really? Are you loyal to Skyrim? Of course. Break into Lord's house and get that letter. Alright, it'll be done. Good. Mind what you say. Of, the of course. His ears all over this town. I don't like the enemy's pyre the myself. Fine day to you, friend. May you die with a sword in your hands. You too. Hi. What's a milk drinker like you doing out here? Oh, Go boy. home to your mother. <sighs> Look. Please don't talk to me like that. Why? What are you gonna do? Cry? No. Look, I don't want any trouble, all right? Gods, you're boring. You hear something? What the? Oh. Oh, where's my weapon? That's the last of them. Who is he? Delacourt. Oh, by the gods. Let's see here. Okay. Goost is responsible for the cemetery here in Falkry. I take care of the shrine. Woo! Hmm. What do you do around here? I'm a bard. Trained at the Bard's at College in Solitude. Wanderers like you should think about applying. Spend less time serving Dengir. Yeah, I'm not no, interested in being a bard, but now. I'll check really it out. Do. Can I make a request, please? Sure. What can I do for you? Um, can you sing Ragnar the Red? Ah, a fine but bloody tale. I can do that one. Thank God my mother taught me that restoration spell. Now, who is this orc? He didn't just attack us for no apparent reason. It's ridiculous. Ah, excuse me. Now, here's a woman I'm glad to see. Have we met? I don't think so. You got heard any rumors around lately? Folks have gone missing the past few weeks. Word now that our hunters are gone too. Really? If you're traveling, could you keep an eye out for them? 
Valder and his men, I think they were after Bear up north. Okay. Look, uh, you got any black briar mead for sale? Take a look. By the gods, I hope so. Yes! Thank you! I'll take this butter too. Um, oh, chicken breast, of course. You hear any juicy gossip in town? Be sure to share it with me. Mm-hmm. Oh, you mm -hmm. talk and you lie and you drink all our mead. Now I... Sorry. Think it's high time that you lied. I escaped um, fighting in secret. Well, I wouldn't complain if we could string together a few sunny days now and then. Of course. Look, I'd like to rent a room, please. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. When his ugly red head rolled around on the floor. Beautiful, beautiful. Let me know if there's anything else you need. All right. Thank you. This will be all. Uh, we're short on gold. <laughs> There's still some things I gotta buy, so... You know, a little thieving here. I mean, oh. they're not gonna use it. Oh, boy. I was two days into my journey from Markarth when the ataxia struck. I thought if I bit down on a piece of cloth it would distract me from the pain, but eventually my joints could bear the weight no longer. I stopped at the roadside ruins looking for a place to rest. It was there in the briars of an autumn fall that I came across a strange altar rooted in the ground. Beside it stood an old woman who I took for its keeper. Taking note of my apprehension, the old woman beckoned me forward. Wordlessly, she raised her hand and directed it toward the altar. She was asking me to choose. In my travels, I have passed through high graven camps and seen many a twisted thing, but none like this. Placed in its gnarled hands were three empty bowls and a cup to fill them. At last, the old woman spoke with an accent I couldn't place. The first bowl, she said, would grant you power. The second would bring you fortune. The third, however, would offer you nothing at all. Looking back now, I can't tell you if any of this was real or some hallucination I dreamt up to cope with the fever. Or it could be the altar was no different than a standing stone, a tribute to a god long forgotten. Still, I felt compelled to ask the woman how and where I would find my boon. She said it would come to me. Unfortunately, the ataxias cursed me with sleeplessness. Worse yet, the disease had progressed to a point that I fear I will not live to see the outcome of my choice. A shame as I wonder even now if I made the right one. Rolnick Winstrider. Oh. Hi, Casey. Welcome to the stream and thanks for joining. All right, what time is it here? 6.15, 14? Um, yeah, let's get some sleep, huh? I'm not too fond of traveling at night, but uh, we're we're gonna go ahead and do it. Morning. Oh. I left my backpack at home. I knew something was missing. <laughs> And I got a bunch of stuff to drop off at home. Maybe we could find a backpack around here, you know? Something to hold us over. Um. Alright, no. Dying Wish traveled to Roadside Ruins. And it was something else we just picked up. Locate Valder's Hunting Party. Steal the private letter from Dengear. Good to see you again, friend. You too. Try 
trying to eat my dinner. Falkreath was once full of wanderers and warriors like yourself. Those were better kings. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. I've got a letter and a lot of gold. Something about it being your, uh, oh, inheritance. Oh, oh no. Sorry for your loss. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Oh. Goodness gracious. Delacour. <laughs> well, he's alive now, so. But we sure he used those 400 pieces of gold. People I don't even really know that dies. Well, this is only the second death I've been notified about. The first one of somebody named Ogre. I don't know who in the world that is. Grey Pine Goods. Ah, man. I need to go in there. Maybe he has a backpack. I don't think we should go breaking into his house. I mean, now. Alright, come here, Marcoria. You keep watch. Alright, come closer. Alright. Don't make me wait too long. I get bored very easily. I'll be right back. If I could just find the letter, grab it. There it is. Okay. Oh, he's waking up. Crap. Okay. Invisibility? Um. I didn't even get to read it. <laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs> oh. That was close. Yes. All right, Try let's go. Try not to go. walk into any spike-filled pits or filthy skeever dens. Well, I suppose the Jarl is asleep. Um. <coughs> where's Dengir? Uh. I mean, we're helping him out, so we should be invited in, right? Falkreath was once full of wanderers and warriors like yourself. Those were better days. Where's your uh, brother? Oh. It's so good to see you again. I was Jarl once, but I was encouraged to step down when I took sides with the Stormcloaks. Yeah, you tell me. It was me. an Imperial plot, I tell you. Of course. Here's the Lord's letter. What's this, some kind of code? I don't know. Need as much iron ore as you can dig up. Well, he's not spying, but it's clear the Empire's making Lods smith up more swords and armor for them. Good work. Take this. Of course. All right, Dengir. What exactly do you need from me? You may have seen the open grave in our graveyard. No. Most of the townsfolk think it's the work of a corpse thief the truth is less pleasant it is was the grave of vigar my own ancestor dead for centuries now he is also a vampire my family is entrusted with keeping him buried but recently someone stole the ward stone and vigar escaped so you're telling me you're related to a vampire? I should kill you where you stand. Hmm. Or was he bitten? Yeah, because you don't have a look of a vampire. I don't think their blood runs through your veins. Okay, so let me guess. You want me to find this war stone then? No, it's too late for the war stone. Vigar must be destroyed. If this gets out... My family will suffer great shame. Mm-hmm. All right, well, I'll see that Vigar is destroyed. Good. He will have fled to gather others of his kind. Look, um... Mind what you say. Of course. The Empire has ears all over this town. I mean, do you have a backpack Falk around here I could was borrow? Once full of wanderers and warriors like yourself. Those were better huh? days. I know. I already know it. <coughs> Can't get this bag of gold. <laughs> it 
It was bad, but not that bad. I'm sorry, I should really go now. Please give me a backpack. Oh, crap. All right, no backpack in here. Well, I'm glad he want us to look for a vampire because I still haven't forgotten my main reason of coming to Skyrim, which is destroying these vampires. All of these bloodsuckers. Oh. All right, let's get out of here. Where's a uh, river? That horse don't never stay put. Ay, ay, ay. Is he still over here? All right, there we go. Let's go. We got a lot to do. Now first, uh, I guess is this dog thing, right? All right, oh, there it is. You are exactly what I was looking for. What? Did you just talk? Yeah, Skyrim is now host to giant flying lizards and two-legged <laughs> cat men. Are you surprised <laughs> by me? Yeah, yeah. I just talk and I'm continuing to do so. All you right. see, my name is Bobbis. And I have a problem I think you can help sort out. So what could a dog possibly need help with? My master and I had a, a bit of a falling out. We got into an argument and it got rather heated. He's kicking me out until I find someone who can settle our disagreement. That's where you come in. Well, what are you two having a disagreement about? Okay. All right, well... I mean, we could go find him, I guess. Thank you. Now, since he banished me, Vile's been rather weak. He can't manifest very far from one of his shrines. I know there's a <laughs> cult that worships him at Hamar's Shane. We should be able to talk to him there. If this works out, I'll make sure you're rewarded. Hey, just don't trust any offer he makes you, okay? Alright. I don't trust you or him, truthfully. Where are we going? Oh, I don't got time for this. God, let me see. Alright, roll side ruins right there. Um, kill the great beast. We got stuff all around us. Destroy the vampire. So, which way are we going to go first? Where is this dog going? Um, I don't know. I guess I got to, like, follow him, follow him. All right. <sighs> think, think, think. All right. Well, let's go up this way because we got to kill the great beast. So I guess we're going to follow the dog, too. Come on, Marcorio. So, uh, exactly where are we going? Barvis. just tell me where we're going I could just meet him there because at this rate we're not gonna make it anywhere well you know I gotta go I'll catch up with you cuz that great beast is somewhere around here
get this Aryan arrow from? This one Aryan arrow. Somebody must have hit me with it. Am I going the right way? My house pointing like up here. That him? Oh! Crap, you kidding me, right? just kill you you know what bump that are you her scene i am the spirit of the hunt just one glimpse of the glorious stalker that your kind calls her scene will you remove the curse from this ring please i may consider it but you must first do a service for my glory the one who stole it has fled to what he thinks is his sanctuary. Just as a bear climbs a tree to escape the hunt, but only ends up trapping himself. Seek out this rogue shifter. Tear the skin from his body and make it an offering to me. I mean, he seems as if he really regrets what he's done. And he's done me no wrong. I, I, I don't know. Um, and I don't serve you, Hercene, anymore. So no, I won't kill him. There is no retribution in the hunt. It is not vengeance I seek, but the blood course of a living hunt. There are others who would gladly accept my favor. They will hunt him while you delay your choice. Yeah, well, you know, then let them kill him. But I'm not doing it. I really need my backpack. Uh, well, I lost River. Um, let's go. Gotta keep moving. Now, let's see where are we off to next. Barbus is way up here, so let's see if we could catch up with him. I guess he's going straight. Oh, oh, we gotta kill that vampire guy as well. So where is he? I think he was close by. No, not Tim. Um, yeah, he's not too far from where I am now. So let's go after him first, and then we'll go after Barbus. No beer jumping out on me. Are we going? Oh, okay, here's a path. What was that? Okay, that wasn't a path. Whoa! <coughs> Out 
the water. It's too cold. All right, now I think this is the path. Man, if we had our horse, we could have get up there quicker. There's a dragon up here. Come on, let's put some pep in our step. Oh, should have dressed a little warmer to know that I would end up back in a snowy land. this place here. <sighs> Ancestors Glade. And we got a shack over here. Let's, let's see. Let's go down here real quick. If I could just get it on my map, then I could like come back later or something. Oh, they're gonna make me jump down. All right, well. Bangies camp. All right. Wait, hold. Oh, there's a river. Perfect. Go boy. Easy, easy, easy. Now I suppose we should uh go fight this dragon, right? But how do we get over there? Do we go up this? I mean, this really isn't a path. And I don't want to have to come back around, so. Alright, let's stick to this path and maybe it'll lead us over there. Well, let's go in here first, right? place that blood has been there some time this is still a bit fresh so these vampires had a kill or something recently Yeah, I didn't mean to take that basket. What was that? I want to 
gonna save my potion. Check every crate, chest, and barrel you see. Who knows, maybe a few of them have something valuable inside. I hope so, right? <laughs> Well, I knocked everything down, and that's empty. Still could have a look around. Empty. Gold. Because I'm home now. Want that. Gotta make sure we use a cure disease potion when we leave here. You always gotta have some handy when wow. you're fighting with vampires. Would you look at that. Ah, uh, seen more things more impressive. Seen other things more impressive, huh? Vampire dust. Totally forgot about vampire dust. <sighs> okay, glad we got some though. Uncommon tape. Let's take that. I guess I was just hearing things. Look, they got a prisoner in here. Hmm. That must be the person's blood we've seen outside, eh? We got a coin purse. What the? Sorry, Marcoria. Too late for that. Get her! Get her! Where'd she go? Oh. Got a wolf in here. We're not leaving anything alive in here, right?
think we're getting closer. There are ports like this all over Skyrim now. The Imperials abandoned most of them a long time ago. Yeah, well, now is it no time for uh some Nord history, uh, Mark Oreo. Yep, there he is. It is no matter. This fool will be the next act of the show. Hmm. Yo! You gotta die, big arm. Where's that lady? Alright, we got two dogs we gotta chase down. Yo! Well, that takes care of that one. Let me search these bodies. Oh, you got him, found them? This ends now! There he is. He doesn't have much health left. Yeah. Ah. I set something off. I don't know what it was. Let's see what's in here. Increase your magicka by 50. Nice. So I wonder if these gargoyles, yep, I'm in the life. What about this one? No, that's an actual statue. Alright, let's go. On to the next. I want to fight that dragon we seen. Now there was a trap by up oh, there it is. I stepped on coming in. Alright, cure disease for sure. Hey River. See that dragon's over here. I don't see no path either. Huh. Can I get up this way? Cause I don't even know how to go, where to go around that to uh, get to him. Ah, come on. Jump, jump. There we go. Hey, you jumped over too? No? Oh, there he is. Look at him. Now, I don't know. This is a, I don't think it's a blood dragon. I think the blood dragons are green. <sighs> okay. Alright, get him to land for me, Marcorio, please. Marcorio. On down. It's gonna move too far up. Ah, crap. Where's 
is he going? Oh gosh. Ah. Got him. Now let's see what you got on you. Well, he had a feast. He ate someone. Animal, animal allegiance. Yeah, what what that do? Oh, the steel soldier armor. Don't I have that at the house? <sighs> I needed the gauntlets or something. Wow. Look at this thing he left. You missed the whole fight, Marcorio. Oh, okay, so there was a path here. Now I gotta find River. Or River will find us. Is this a cave? Bone Chill Passage. I guess we gotta go through to get down? Come on. Oh, look at this. Uh oh. Troll. Yo! Oh, no, 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 no. Wrong thing. Don't panic. You panic and things are over. I told you, when she has her mindset of a warrior she does great the moment she start panicking she does horrible look at this this cold is unbearable it's all i can do not to shiver until my teeth rattle well if you actually moved around like i did fighting then uh you won't be so cold i mean it is chilly in here so let's keep moving keep your eyes open I don't know what else we're gonna find in here a little snack is that a body? it is a bandit I hate ice breath. Thank you. I got some boots. Now, I don't know where it's gonna, this leads, takes us. Oh. Alright, where are we? Oh, okay. Still where we were. Now, where's Barbus? He's up here. Hey, Marshane. Okay. So, let's remove this. And let's go meet up with Barbus. I'm glad we didn't, like, exactly follow him. Because he was going so slow. And we were... I don't know when he actually made it there. But we were able to get some things taken care of some of the uh requests jobs uh oh well must have run off <laughs> what an oblivion are you guys doing out here you and there, where's uh, your shoes citizen this area is off limits you're interfering with the Imperial business. Yeah, so you'll have to pay us a fine. Say, a hundred gold. Pay up, citizen. Pay up my bounty this time. I'm not paying you a single septum, first of all. So, 
If you could take it off of me, you could have it. If you insist. Come on, boys. This'll be fun. You're right. This will be fun. <laughs> Ow! We still got somebody hiding in the bushes. You can't beat me. I can take this. <laughs> Marcorio, watch it. it. Just hit me. Those were an imperial so what in the <laughs> They killed the real Imperial soldiers and took their gears. What are they? Scavengers? Not good. I just seen a shack down here. Let's go. Gotta keep moving. I earned this, these uh, septums. I'm not giving them up. You know, this would be a nice little place to stay. Got a nice little waterfall over here. Come on, Marcorio. You gotta wash that blood and stuff off of us. Yep. Feels good, huh? Nice and warm. You gotta swish around a little. Alright, we're nice and clean again. By the nine, what happened? Oh no. Note to the authorities. I have heard talk about the dragons, but didn't believe it until now. One flew by last week, and ever since we have seen him fly back and forth from a nearby mountain peak. My wife thinks we should move away, go somewhere else. I told her that would be nonsense. As long as we don't bother, it won't bother us. Still, I thought it would be best if we reported to the local authorities. The creature's lair is just south the hill behind our shack near Beer's Cave Mill. Beer's Cave Mill? So there's another dragon living around here? Because we came from Bone Chill Passage. Beer Caves Mill. I haven't heard of that. This sounds like a good read. Let's take this. You ever heard of Beer Caves Mill? Or whatever it says. No, I haven't. All right, come on, Marcorio. We gotta find River. Meet up with River. Or River meet up, catch up to us. I mean, they did give that cave a good name, Bone Chill Passage. will take your mind off your troubles. Well, these Imperials aren't having a good day today, right? <laughs> oh well. If you know Actually I could use any true ar arrows of Skyrim. Tell them to head I don't the have that many Ulfric Stormcloak wants to see them. Of course. I'll spread the word. This doesn't concern you, friend. Hey, we're just passing through is all. Stay your hand, please. Now, what was I saying? Yeah, I don't have many, um...
fire arrows. Oh, look at all the bees. Let's get them. Need some stamina potions. Get the bees. Fresh kill we'll take. Oh, the hive is empty. It's probably because they're all out here flying around. They didn't produce any uh, honey and stuff yet. This is a decent bandit camp for sure. I can say that. Alright, let's go. Uh, ouch! Darn it. Marcorio? Alright. Where is River? I mean, you were with him last when I went to go fight that dragon. Thought you would have brought him over to me. Uh, now, what's this? See some bandits in here. What the? All right, um, let's try to go around. Hopefully, we can. Oh, well. <laughs> They're fighting up there. It's a brawl up there. What's going on? You start that so I can stand in the back. I'll rip your heart out. It's so much easier to run. Dead. You. All right, so we got some low life bandits, but who are they fighting? Oh, a bit of everyone. A Thalmor soldier. The storm cloaks. Ah, oh, I wish we could have got here in time to save them. And more Thalmor. <sighs> I actually have this outfit already. Very nice. What's he aiming at? Someone in the ground? I don't know, but let's get out of here. We don't want no parts of this. What the? Yeah, no, we're not going to help out, come on. Because last time we helped out a group of uh, Stormcloak soldiers and Imperials, um, we got killed, so we're just going to mind our business, right? Right. Now, there was a horse that's supposed to be over here, but he's not showing up. And I already came by this area when I had to get Nettlebane, and I didn't see the horse. And not only that, I had another quest that's cutting up. Yeah, like, where is he? I can't even complete this quest because the horse is in my A. And he should have been right over here. And I even looked way down there and didn't see him. So I don't know. What's going on? Didn't we have an update recently? So I think that update could have broke some of the uh, Creation Club quests. I suppose so. I guess. So I don't know where that horse is. Oh, no, 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 no. Never mind. I'm tripping. I'm thinking of a last save, but I had went back and all that stuff. So 
because the horse wasn't there, but I did get that one. All right, so we're good. Let's see what they got for sale over here. You must be all right if you've got time to complain. Can we have this? Thanks. Hi. Take a look. See, he already know. Absorb 15 points of health? Oh, we are so getting it. Okay. Shock resistance by 50. Major destruction. I'm trying to find the bones of Mupo. Here, you can have that. Okay, so I got 25 points frost damage. Same for fire. Um, lightning as well. That goes home. Um, absorb 10 points. Yeah, that goes home as well. Let's see. I could sell... Um, imminent archery. Didn't I pick up more than one cultist stuff? I got only the gloves and the mask. What happened to the uh outfit? Cause I was gonna put it on my um mannequin at my farm. So I just might as well sell that till I get the whole thing right. We got deer hide pelt. What's the difference? I don't know. I don't like when my stuff isn't stacked. Alright, thanks. We'll take this. Alright, come on. You know, let's get a little sleep before we meet up with Barbas. Oh, thought I could have slept there. Yeah, I know, we don't own it. I was hoping. Can we take one? Oh, River! Mwah! Good to have you back, boy. Let's go. We love River. So now that Fenoria is going by her birth name, which is Freya, maybe we should change River's name. But I like the name River for him. But give him a nice name that sounds fearsome. I think this is it. Well, where's Barbus? Did he go inside? He told us to meet him outside. So I guess he went inside. I don't know. I don't hear him barking or anything. Okay, here we go. We gotta be quick on our feet dealing with these vampires. Huh? Barbus, are you in here? Alright, it says travel with him. Where is he, though? It's saying he's here. Alright. Come on. Don't go stopping for a nap. If you fall asleep in this place, you'll never wake up. Of course, not with these vampires around. We may feed again today. Oh, you're not feeding off of me, lady. Ah! 
They're hungry. I don't know. I think it's something with the moons. Got these vampires coming out. Well, we're in their lair, but, you know, they've been coming out more often than not. being thrown on me. She sure was enjoying a meal. Why she didn't share with the other lady? I mean, vampires look out for one another, unlike bandits. You get some good loot and you're in a crew with bandits, you better watch your hide. I don't see bandits turn on each other many times Hello? don't like the looks of this thought I heard something you! Someone there. Uh! watch your uh! back Just die! come on Marcorio uh! I'm going to Thank enjoy you. this who said that was just a pretty face come on watch it move it all right where are you kill yeah you gotta show me how to do that that's why she plan on going to uh, the college of winter hole because she wants to learn destruction magic like she wants to be there's no greater madness than those who seek to become really good at destruction magic and that's another reason why she left Skyrim too because the people back home, the red guards back home, they frown upon magic users. Spider. <laughs> juice definitely got to wash that off look at this barbus are you in here Barbus? <laughs> nice stagger there. Well, that's not Barbus. <laughs> Not the 
Take that as a thank you. I'll take that. Now, Barbus, where are you? Cause you said you was gonna wait for me. You couldn't wait any longer. All right. Well, where's your master? What? You wanted me to come talk to your master. Darn it. Uh, Clavicus, I have a request of you. By all means, let's hear it. It's the least I could do since you already helped me grant one final wish for my last worshippers. They were suffering so from vampirism and begged me for a cure. Then you came and ended their misery. I couldn't have planned it better myself. So, what's your heart's desire? What kind of deal can we strike? Well, apparently you don't care about your followers. <sighs> but I'm just here to reunite you with Barbus. Ah, uh, that insufferable pup! Forget it! Request denied! No deal! What? I'm glad to be rid of him. Even if it does mean I'm stuck in this pitiful shrine. In the back end of nowhere. Well... Perhaps there is a way he could earn his place back at my side? Maybe. But no promises. Oh boy. What are you offering? What's, what's the offer? What, what do you want? There's an axe. Of course. An incredibly powerful axe. An axe powerful enough for me to have quite a bit of fun indeed. Okay. If you bring it to me, I'll grant you my boon. No strings attached. No messy surprises. At least not for you. As I recall, it's resting in Rhyme Rock Burrow. Barbers can lead you right to it. Little Mutt might even earn his place back at my side. Well, I guess I have no choice. So, I don't even know if, well, what's the story behind this rueful act? One of Clavicus' little Jess, a wizard named Sebastian Lord, had a daughter who worshipped her seed. Hmm. When the daughter became a werewolf, it drove Sebastian over the edge. He couldn't stand to see his little girl take on such a bestial form. The wizard wished for the ability to end his daughter's curse. <laughs> Clavicus gave him an axe. Oh, I see. All right, well, can you stay here? I'll go get it. All right, then. We'll get together later. No, we won't. I hope not. I don't need him following me around. <laughs> that pure disease potion. Oh, is that big chest for this stuff? Alright. Oh! I don't want to fall now. Okay, stupid axe. Axe, axe, axe. Where is this place? Over by North Watch Keep. Is he kidding me? <laughs> uh, now, what's here? 
All right, so I gotta go. I mean, we're close to White Run, so I do gotta go to this place for this guy. His journals here. So let me see where are we? Oh, come on. Okay, so go that way. But that's way over there. He might not be getting that axe today, I'll tell you one thing. Because we still got all this other stuff to do. So I could do, like, hit here, come all the way around, grab the axe, then make my way towards here to get this stuff taken care of. But then that means I still got to come back here to bring him the axe. All right, well, I guess that's uh, what's best, right? Where's the river? So that means no shenanigans with you, river. Because I am not running all the way over there. So I think my best bet will be to go this way. Show through Iris dead. Well, maybe I could cut through like Iris said or something. Let's see. Yeah, if I come down this way. But if I go back through Riverwood, go down that bridge. Yeah, I think that will probably be my best bet because that looked like a bunch of mountains or something I will have to get over. So Marcorio had a horse, but <laughs> he didn't do right by the horse, so I had to take it away. Ho, ho, ho. All right, white run is this way. So y'all will be happy with receiving this um black briar mead so lucky for us we didn't have to go all the way to Riften to get some and with us being gone this long maybe it'll make the y'all think that we ho ho actually went all the way to Riften to get his batch of black a fine day mead. to you friend may you die with a sword in your hand you too Hey, Alvor. Whatever you need. Buy you smear if it's simple and strong. I can forge it. Of course. What do you got today? Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. So we have 10 points of magicka. I want something higher than that. <gasps> ah! He got him! Oh my god! You guys don't know how much I've been looking for the muffle enchant. Thank you, Alvor. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I am so happy. Thank you. I could kiss you. Right, <laughs> Thank you. 
All right, I'm going to do a hard save so my screen going to go blue. But I'm still going to be here. Oh, my God. I am so freaking happy. Ay, ay, ay. Papa? I am so happy. <laughs> yes! I need to keep forging. Today is a great day for Freya. See? Ah! Wait. Once she decided to start... Okay, wait, wait, wait. Accepting her birth name and all of that stuff, whatever it says in the description. Things has really been great for her. She's been fighting like a warrior, excellent. You know, using her Redgar heritage, strength, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> um been finding some really great stuff that I've been keeping my eyes open for and uh, now the boots are muffled. I am so happy when I least expected it that's when I found them because I was driving myself a bit crazy by doing that whole kill glitch merchant thing. I tried it with Rattad. I tried it with Balamin. I even went to Windhelm and tried it with the Smithered Ear. Um, is that a quartz? Get out of here, wolf. So, you know, I'm really, really happy. I don't know who that is, but he could take care of that wolf for us. Alright, let's go. really happy and we're almost there so that wasn't a bad ride at all so it might not be a bad ride um for the rest of the the way we gotta go once we uh, leave this place Did that deer just push us? I am so happy. Now I think I need, I'm not 100% sure, I gotta check my cupboard at home. But I think we still need like a good sneaking um, enchant. All right, we gotta go over there. All right, stay here, River. No, stay right there. All right, let's get in this water. Uh, it's a bunch of uh, dragonflies and stuff around. Yep, this is the place. Oh God, look at all of this. All this blood. Oh, gold. That's never a good sign when you see a bunch of blood outside of a place. There's a cave here. Think we should check it out? Of course. This is actually our destination. You ready? Oh. So maybe that's who blood this is. So if the bandit killed the Nord, who killed the bandit? Or if the Nord killed the bandit, who killed the Nord? I don't know. Keep your eyes out open. Keep your eyes out. <laughs> keep your eyes open, I meant to say. Yeah, keep your eyes out. like to listen to my t oh, surroundings before I go in. This is some animal of some sort that did this. Look like the work of some vampires, trolls. 
Not even the old bull cord bear. This cold is unbearable. It's all I can do not to shiver until my teeth rattle. It's not that cold in here, Marcorio. It's actually warm. Look at this. Maybe more vampires for sure. Don't like the looks of this. Me either. Trolls. Yo! Now how did his journal get lost in here? I mean, maybe when he came exploring here, uh, there wasn't, um, trolls in here then, you know? more gold up there? Yes. All right. Some good finds for sure. I suppose these people came in here to probably explore, you know, some made it further than others. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Oh, got another troll, and another troll. <laughs> okay, here come his buddy. There's something up there. But then there's an entrance over there, too. Well, let's see what this one is. Wait a minute, it's two. Alright. Got a gold. Oh. What's in this next one? Oh, God's nothing. willing, we'll find a <laughs> chest full of gold in one of these chambers. Well, I mean, we just found a little gold, not much. I don't understand what you're saying. Oh, so I wonder what fish you could get out of here. Is there any in the water now? Let me take a closer look. <gasps> a dire fish? Any more? Maybe we should stop and do a little fishing. I don't have a fishing pole though. Is there one up here? No. Let me look at that fish. What would be under? Yup, food. Oh, it's smaller than what it looked like under in the water. I don't see. 
see any more. That was a really great find. What else they got in here? Pork or meat? More gold. Let's get this. And near some bed rolls, we could get some sleep real quick. So we still got places to go. Seemed pretty safe and quiet. The sound of the water. Get them a nice eight hour rest. Yeah, see? And let's eat something. Ah, cheese. Where did I get this from? Cheese. Oh, that should do. Oh, there's another quartz. Are you sure you can find your way? It would be easy to get lost in here. No, I think I got it. I hear another one. some small antlers trying to find as many ingredients as I can before I start learning alchemy here's his journal let's see how long is it pretty long so look like a good read but yeah I'm not gonna read all of this right now it's this way. Yeah, because it was all the debris. Did we look up there at all? Let me see. Nothing up there. Nope. Alright, let's get on out of here. Let's go for a swim, get that smell off of us. Yeah, what is that? Oh. Oh. <sighs> that should do. All right, let's go, River. We gotta hit the next spot. Let me see. So we were coming. Oh, we got to go. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'm going. Uh, we going to fast travel over here. I'm not riding way over there. Bump that. We'll fast travel there. 
and will fast travel back to Haymarsh Shane. All right, I'll go on foot from here. Let's see what we can find. You got any claws on you? I hope. Yo! <gasps> Marco Horio <laughs> I wanted to search his body. Yes. All right. Got some beer cloth. I like looking underwater. Never know what you'll find. What's that anchor spot over there? Oh, look, some fish. Pearlfish. Oh, get it. Wait, wait, wait. It's a bunch over here. Wait. I can't really see. All right, got another one. One just jumped up. Pearlfish. Where's the other one? I just seen it. Move, Marcorio. Wait, I got it back up so I could see. There it is. Got it. Wow. Oh, and let's get some clam. Make some, uh, I think it was Nord Stew that uses the clan. Something else. This is great. Oh, come on. You still can't be yawning now. We got some rest. I think we got enough clam for now. I don't want to take it all. You know? Come on, River. What is the horker doing way up here? I thought they stay closer to water. Maybe that one's lost. I don't know. So this clavicus. Vow. Um, you know, you can't trust no danger. I think he's a danger prince. But you see how he do? He helped this guy, Sebastian, out. And then turn around and basically renege on the whole deal. That's why you never make a deal with a danger. You hear that, Marcorio? My grandparents and parents taught me that, and their parents, and so forth and so forth. And it always been proven to be true. Some people get so desperate that they do it. Then they regret it at the end, if they live to tell about it. So, you may say, well, why am I getting the axe for him? Just so Barbas could go back to him and they could go off and do whatever danger things that they do. Try to get him out of Skyrim. And if it seems innocent enough, you know, that still doesn't... I shouldn't be doing this at all. I know that much. I wonder what's down there. I see some wolves. I can hear them too. Be careful on that board. Oh, 
it's dark in here. Let's uh here look this. Oh glad I did. Get him, Marcorio. You don't have a chance. Woo! Alright. Stack of fireballs. Well, here's the axe. It doesn't look like nothing special. Some nightshade. Here's a chest. Bed. So he actually lived in here. Uh, okay, I could take that, I guess. It's a soul gem. Guess that's it. Huh? Come on. Even with the snow here, this cave is a little warm. Yeah, let me put this out before. I'm trying to, you know, really save my torches for emergencies. And they go out pretty quick, so. You gotta be careful. Alright, so we just, like I said, gonna fast travel from here because I didn't want to do this in the first place. <sighs> but we did it. So we got one, two, three, four quests all around here. What's this? Oh. So let's go. T -t -t -t. I guess maybe here and then near there and make our way back to Falkree. I'm glad I got that place on my map because I didn't even, you know, realize there was a quest there. So that's good. There's a cave here. Think we should check it out? Of course. Let's go. Um, all right. Now, her scene wants us want us to kill Cindy. wow would you look at that oh wow this yeah, cold this... is unbearable it's all i can do not to shiver until my teeth rattle are you anemic or something what's going on with you you don't look so well truthfully did you get sick by one of those uh vampires here divine smile on you friend you too. I am an apprentice wizard. I not know, a pack I mule. know. Oh, very well, but make it quick. I need to get you to use a shrine. That's what it is. Here. Please drink that. If not, then we'll get you to a shrine. Let's get going then. Bye. What? This is a bloodbath. Has the Blood Moon called you, fellow hunter? What an oblivion happened here? The prey is strong. 
stronger than the hunters. But more will come. Bring him down for the glories of Lord Hirsin. Okay. Oh, gosh. Look at this. Is there any fish in here? No, but a chest. See? Searching underwater. Never know what you'll find. You. Why? Sending? Oh. I've been told to kill you. And I would deserve it, wouldn't I? I can't stop Truthfully, you if that's what yeah. you want to do. Her sing is too powerful. But if you spare me. I can be a powerful ally to you. And I would promise to never return to civilized life. I know now that I can't live among people. But what's gonna happen when you get hungry again and run out of food? No one shows up here for months, years. You're gonna be forced to go out and hunt. But, uh, I don't live for her scene, so... I'll spare your life, Cindy, for the moment being. Thank the gods. Now let's deal with these other hunters. We hunt together. But you still gotta pay for what you did to that little girl. To blazes with the uh, hearsing. Nice uh, pillar. I'm gonna be a mighty king. <laughs> That's what this part remind me of. When they held Simba up. What's that noise? Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Okay. So I have the orcish where it went the boots the helmet and the light armor boots so there's heavy armor and light armor nice take extra care you don't hit your head on a low-hanging bit of stone Marcorio is going sick. Yeah. Hey, Cartel. <laughs> Yeah, right? It sounded like he wanted us to actually hit our head. That's why them two always arguing, Marcorio and uh, Brea. I don't know what's that static sound. This I can't <laughs> die. Whoa! He pushed me off of him and almost killed us. Sorry. <laughs>
Please don't tell me they're fighting. You can't beat me. Would you stop my choreo? No. Marcorio just totally screwed it for me. Oh, he's going to follow me out. Okay. Let me reload real quick. Screen going to go blue. Oh, my goodness. That's because he was zapping away like a madman. Darn it. Huh? Oh. And something told me something told me when I first started now fighting the blood you to save. But more will come. Bring him down for the glories of Lord Hirsin. Oh. Goodness May gracious. You on warm sands. What? How are you going to tell me to walk on warm sands and you just gasped your last breath? What in the sorcery is going on in here? Oh, oh. This cold is unbearable. That's all I can do not to shiver until my teeth rattle. Well, I'm gonna rattle you if you do that again. So don't. You. And I would... I can't... But you spare me. I know now. Thank to gods. Now let's deal with these other hunters. We hunt together. Of course. Come on. All right, let me save. Look out! Wow. Yeah, I don't need that great sword. I didn't mean to take that. Hey, do this lead somewhere? No. Yeah, I don't know what's that static noise inside of here. Time to end this game. You can't. Uh, Marcorio, stop! You just shocked him again. Oh, please don't start fighting, guys. Oh, that was close. Okay, let's save again. <laughs> Oh, you seen that bat face? Yo! Oh no 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 no! <laughs> Ouch! Oh, okay. That's why he was doing so much damage. Alright, you know what? Does that not get rid of my leather stuff? We'll take all of that. Alright, come on, sending. So! I know this little trick to get his skin and the ring. So that's what we're going to do. Thank you for your help. I will make my home here away from anyone I might hurt. Of course. Better behave yourself, too. So I'm going to leave him right there. Come out real quick.
Well met again, Hunter. Not a failure, my servant. By bringing down my other hunters, you turn the chase inside out. And they were no base prey. You continue to amuse and impress. Go forth with my blessing. All right, here's the ring. Where's her scene? Did they patch this? No! Oh, woo! You've done well, Hunter. And found my favor. That skin will serve you well, child. Look more closely at it. My glory shall protect you from all this world's grievances. Good hunting. Man, that was a close one. I thought that they uh, patched it. All right, so now we got the skin, which is this, and I absolutely love this. All right, let's go. So we have both the ring and the uh, skin. Alright, so the next spot, let me see, have to go to, it's over here. Okay, so this guy, they said, uh, I think they said he used to run with the Crimson Dirt, but now he's hiding out in the woods as a hunter. This was a bounty for the guards, I got it out of the, uh, Fulcrete of uh, Brax. What the? That's a huge spider. All right, stay here. I don't want River running off, but now because the spider decided to come over here, he's going to. <gasps> I'm not dying today. I am Redguard. I am not dying today. here
River Fountain, please. Thunderstone Gorge. Up, oh, there's the guy, right? All right, I didn't choose to be alone. A fish doesn't choose to swim and a bird doesn't choose to fly. They just are, and so was I. When the guard raided our hideout, I didn't shed any tears. We were always going to be lost children, orphaned by the world, if not by each other. The others fled to the cities, but I saw the stillness of the forest with only the moon and the stars to keep me company. That is, until the day I met the wolf. When I found his leg caught in a bear trap, my first thought was to put it out of his misery. Yet, for some reason, I treated the wound and fed the beast until it recovered. I don't know why I saved it. Perhaps part of me misses the others and longs for a companion. I'm no strong stranger to solitude. I spent years relying on no one save myself. But it seems at the end of the day, I'm still that boy at the orphanage parked at the windowsill, staring out into an empty street. versions are there of the Crimson Dirk books? I never even read any of these. And this is about him. Hmm. You know what? Let's take this. So we get this armor. Nah. Put that up. Alright. Next spot. Look like this is on a mountain or something. Hunter's breast. Alright, so it's near a shack. That's not it. This way. That was a mighty fine elk. <laughs> What's lurking? What is that? Oh. Alright, we gotta find a way up there. there yeah moss mother camera hello you over here please I need help thank Kinnereth for you stranger I'd almost given up hope of walking away from here Oh, you're Valder. The lady at the end in Fall Creek told me you were up here. What are you doing? We tracked a bear to this den. Good coin for those pelts. We had the big sow cornered when they showed up. Three of them, out of nowhere. Spriggins. Niels went down before we even knew to run. Ari died just inside. I never even thought the things were real. I may have lost a drop or two of blood. Truth is, I'm not going anywhere like this. Ah, uh, hurts to breathe. Um, I may know a spell that will work. Thank you. Please hurry. No. Scaled armor, eminent square. Where'd that come from? 
Did he give me that? Time to talk. Snitch or double cross me and I'll kill you. I mean it. What? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, much better. Thanks, friend. I wouldn't have lasted much longer without that. But now what? I can't just walk away. Not with my friend's bodies in there being torn apart by those beasts. Um, you know, don't be foolish. Let me do it. You'd really risk your life for a stranger's honor? I don't even know what to say. Thank you, my friend. I'll wait here. Where that guy went? I don't know. That that was strange. All right. Oh. There's his friend Ari. <sighs> Rest in Sabengar. Don't go stopping for a nap. If yeah, you fall asleep in this way. place, you'll never wake up. I just leaped up there and uh I'll say got around. Oh, I see a spriggan. Done looking around, actually. Some Namara's rock. This place is beautiful. Got some Aryan. Yeah, we might as well get it right. I mean, this isn't a actual mine in the place, but. Save us a few septums mining our own stuff. Anything else up there? I'm trying to see if I can. There's his other friend, Neil. Wow. Would you look at that? Yeah, this cave is beautiful. I, I, I must say. How many friggin's in here? Hey, let's search the water. Is there anything up here? But let's see if there's any uh, fish or chests in the water. There's a quartz and a sword. That's all I see. Yep, there's nothing under here. It's always worth a look though, I think. Get this. At times like this, I truly appreciate the joys of a warm fire and a stiff drink. You know, you sure been doing a lot of complaining today. Why? Is it because you see me becoming a warrior I was meant to be? Mm -hmm. Don't give me that side eye, my Corio. It up here. There's nothing up there. All right, come on. Hi, Dallas. What kind of dragon is this? I never seen no 
all spreading like that. Oh, there's a chest. And some boots. Alright. Seems like the bigger the chest, the less stuff you find in it. I guess that's it in here? Still don't know why I can't pick that up. Guess it's stuck. I think we're getting to the point where even though it seems like, you know, she's doing very well today, which we are, um, we had a rough couple of streams yesterday, the day before. It's done then. Justice, if you can call it that. Look, I want you to have this. I know it isn't much, but it's important to me. Ari gave me this dagger when we first started hunting together. I always said it brought her luck. You should be the one to carry it now. I'll give them a proper burial, then head back. Come find me if you're ever in Falkreath. You'll always be welcome at my door. Of course. Thank you, Valder. I'm actually headed back to Falkreath now. Hope to see you. Yeah, so we had, you know, some bad streams, but, um... I think it's time that we definitely start looking for a better sword. Because I don't know how much longer <laughs> we're going to be able to keep using this, uh, what is it, Dawn, dawn Breaker? And it could be, well, no, I can't say it's the armor because we had on um, silver armor in the armor rating was higher than what this armor is so what the oh you scared me river all right yeah let's head back to where are we Fault Creek. so we still gotta okay return his journey travel to the roadside ruins right and bring the yarl some mead back Okay, so we'll save that for tomorrow because I'm actually about to end the stream. And before I do, we're going to travel home real quick, drop off all of our goodies. I am so happy about the boots of muffle. I am ecstatic about getting those. Ew, look at that thing. All right, River, I'll see you later. Mwah. Be good, boy. We're only level 26. I got to work on my alchemy and smithing. I did make some more dagger. Wait, did I make more daggers? Because I haven't been finding as many as I normally have. So let me see. How many I got? 17. So, I need to make some, I guess, and go ahead and enchant those. And then I'll go to the blacksmith, pay for smith and training, and sell the daggers to get some money back. So, before we even attempt that, let's see what we have to put up. Let's start with weapons. Okay, so all of the, okay, the majority of the stuff is going in here. This is all the stuff I want to disenchant. So I did find another weapon like this, but for higher, higher. 
I think I found higher for that in this. Um, I'm not sure about that. Magicka, I think I found a higher one of that. And I think I found imminent gloves. I'm not sure. Let me just clear. All right, you know what? Let me just take it all out, right? We'll start over. So let's do weapons. Wait. Okay, yeah, absorb 20 points of stamina. So I'll put that up. 25 points of frost damage. 25 burn. Creatures and people. Let me see. What's this called? Despair. Okay, so I found if target dies within 15 seconds, fill a soul gem. So we're 15 points of stamina we get. Okay, see, devouring. Wait, oh, yeah, devouring. Absorb 15 points of health. Summon Daedra, 20. Shock, uh, 25. Undead, up to level 21. Flee for 30 seconds, up to level 21. Okay, this is Daedra. Creatures and people. Oh, so that's like two different things. So creatures and people up to level 13 flee from combat. 30 seconds. And the other one was... Oh, where is it? Undead. Okay. Okay, I see. Alright, so... Shock. Oh, I gotta bring that axe back. Okay, so we're gonna put this dagger up here on display. Right? Right. Um, so let's do apparel now. We have shock resistance by 40, major wel welding 25. Okay, imminent destruction. Wonderland Frost. Okay, imminent alteration. Imminent blocking. This is the shield I'm actually using now, so I'll wait to put that up when I'm ready to start disenchanting. Carrying capacity by 35. Conjuring. Okay, I do have imminent welding. I knew it. So one-handed attacks do 30% more damage. The other one was 25%. Okay, so we'll sell that. Um, increase frost resistance by 40, right? All right, so frost resistance 40, that's fine. Um, two-handed attack. Increase heavy armor skill by 17 points. Um, that's major, okay. This is only minor. Health regenerate. I'm still looking for that. Okay, imminent magicka increases your magicka by 50 points. Okay. Um, bring a recharge and magicka regenerates. Okay, so it's different. There's an increase in the regeneration. So we'll hold on to that. Imminent square increases light armor skill by 20 points. So we'll save that. Imminent archery will save. Our boots of muffle we'll put up. Um eminent smithing, okay. Eminent welding. So I do have two weldings. And this is major. And we got conjuration. Okay, so light armor. Okay, that's heavy. Which I don't even really put points into my light armor or heavy armor. Well, I haven't put any points into either. Does it make a difference? Like, is it a good thing to really do? Like a must-have thing? Frost resistance. Thought I had fire resistance. Imminent welding. Let me make sure I got that before I go selling it. Okay. Um, increase your stamina by 30 points. I could save that. I don't normally, I, I don't want to put nothing that's going to increase like my Magicka health or stamina. I'd rather use the regeneration if I can. Okay, a minor two-handed text do 50% more damage. Maybe I should wait for that, right? 
High boots of strength carry capacity by 35. That was the highest I've seen so far, but I'm certain there got to be something higher. Okay, shock resistance 40. So I need fire resistance. I don't have fire resistance. All right. So let's go put our clothes up. We got... All right, so our leather armor will go in here. These are clothes that will wear like, you know, regular clothing. But I know the leather armor is supposed to be armor, but I still look at that as regular clothing. And this, our guard armor. Okay, we're saving that. Got to put that up. So I got some stuff in here that I'm trying to find the rest of the pieces to. So I did get some orcish items, the heavy helm and boots and the light boots. So I'll wait for the rest of those. All right, so then I'll put <clears throat> my arrows and bolts in here. I might as well put my fire arrows up. I need more. Um, I guess I'll keep using the steel arrow. And this is what we're using, Dawnbreaker. And it only does 26 damage. Alright. Alright. Okay, so this Elven Hunter armor, I really don't care for. The one we just found from killing that hunter out there. So I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with that. Amulet of Julianus, do I have that? No, I do have Stendard, though. Okay, so, Amulet, Julianus. I have Stendard. Brawler, Scale, Breaker, Dunarm, Strikes do 10 additional damage. I could put those up for Disenchant, right? Alright. So... I'm actually probably put this in the kids room because I put this up here. Well, no, that could stay there. Come on, Marcoria. So where would I put this elven armor? I guess maybe up here. Because it didn't come with a helm, right? Because I said I was trying to find something to go with a helm this helm let's see how it looks oh that actually worked all right so then we got another helm um it's called stadia's helm increases your stamina by 70 points so we'll put that on that and then just find an outfit or something to go up there with it uh let's see staff of fireballs i don't think i'm gonna keep this so i was keeping like staffs that i got like this like those are pretty rare i guess i, I got those from quest and this is a name somebody else staff named gandor i found I think that's it so all of those weapons I could sell and all of this armor except for this I could sell so I gotta put that ring of her scene up and um, stuff so let's uh I put all the jewelry in here all right ring of her scene and we'll put that in here. Well, no, actually, let me hold on to that. I could put this, but I was thinking, I think I want to wear this. So before I put it on the um, mannequin, we're going to get a wear or so out of it. 
right, that Savior tie. All right, so that's that. Now, let's disenchant. I don't think I learned the conjuration. Like, I don't mind disenchanting that right now because I don't plan on using that, even though I do use one conjuration spell, which is a... Uh, Which is a uh, conjuring that flame astronaut. Alright. So everything else I'm not touching. Right. Right. So then let's go down here. Where's my Smith in that? 45. trying to get it to 50 actually 70 glass armor 70 yeah we gotta get our cemented up so let's take all of this If I make some jewelry or something, well, I still need army daggers, so let's whip up some of these to enchant and sell. purchase some more iron ingots and maybe I could find a mine to go to to actually mine some iron ore. Alright. Now let's see if we can make some jewelry. Flawless garnet. Okay, we got a few flawless garnet. I'm gonna make one more of those. Um, silver ruby. Oh, what about amethyst? Golden Ruby Circlet. Right. Do I have a diamond? Make a gold diamond ring. So I had a gold diamond ring, but sold it by accident. No. All right. So I found the gold diamond necklace. Okay, so then I'll just put this stuff back up. This is to make some leather strips and stuff with, so I'll put, oh no, not those. All right. Where's Marcorio? Oh, let me put that jewelry up first. Oh, okay, I do got the gold diamond necklace, gold ruby necklace. I'm missing a gold diamond ring I really, really want. So 
So I'll put that in there. Because I know I could wear like several rings. So I got one, two, three. The gold diamond neck uh, gold diamond ring will be four. And I could do like a regular gold ring. So that'll be five. So we got 89 daggers now. I'm not gonna uh, enchant all of them because I actually gotta get more soul gems filled. I was hoping I could find, well, you know what? Maybe I could use that dagger I planned on disenchanting. Cause I was running around with an Aryan sword and uh, <laughs> that's not cutting it anymore. Trying to fill soul gems. actually sold those we just do the stamina or magic or damage enchant Now, what level can Balaman train you up to? And uh, what's his name? Um, the other guy in White Run. So I don't know if I I got seven thousand gold on me. Let's go run there real quick. We could get some smith and china. Oh, let's see what she got for sale. Got some good looking to protect yourself or deal some damage. Okay. Major smith and shop. Oh, I need it fire resistant, so we'll take that. Here's the heavy light armor gauntlet we don't have. We'll take that. Okay, and we'll purchase some more iron and stuff. Oh crap, I'm broke. Alright, well, no problem. Hey, don't stiff me neither. Uh, <laughs> what's your face? I don't want to sell those daggers to you. Those go to what's his name. Which I might have to sell her soon. Yeah. You know what? I got some stuff to Don't sell. Don't forget to check thing. inside the shop if you need anything. So that'll give us some extra money. Let me know if you see anything you like. You and me take a look. Yeah, don't start your mess, uh. Oh, see, here go the cultist robes. And I was gonna keep. I done sold the. Uh, <laughs> ah, stupid. And we got all this jewelry to sell. Magicka regenerate. 
17, I'm at 100% faster. I don't have nothing with sneaking on it. All right, I'm not gonna buy it. Hopefully, we'll be able to find what we're looking for, you know? Do come back. Uh, while exploring this stuff. All right, let's see if I could sell some jewelry to her. I. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. You are such a sweetheart, you know that? Oh, wow, you don't really have no money. Here, you could afford this. You take care of yourself now. Oh, you too. Ripe fruit Such and fresh sweetheart. vegetables for sale. All right. Terrible and powerful Talos. We are unworthy servants. Get praised. All right, I hear the hammer, so he must be up there. All right, let's level up real quick. All right, you're Got a lot of steel to shape. Good, good. It's an honorable craft. I'll show you what I can. Goodness, I can't even afford Gosh, to go all the way up to five. Oh. And this is why I need to finish and chant the rest of these. It's an honorable craft. I'll show you what I can. Well, we're level 58 now, so. We could create scaled and plate armor. What's this one? Can't create orcish armor and weapons. Um, I don't know. Which one's better, orcish or... Advanced armor. Uh, oh, I think I could do both. Wait a minute. Alright. So then this should be... Alright, now I could put... really don't have trouble with blocking. Um, I can do a one-handed attack with swords, have a 15% chance to do a more critical. I don't use maces. Yeah, let me check out. What's this light armor then? Increase armor rating for light armor by 20%. Oh, okay. So I think I could do that. Oh, okay. I see. I've never done that before. So let me do... Where's heavy armor? Because I wear both. Heavy and light. Dag, I should have checked out my armor before I did it. Let me see. Yeah, because it was not 59. Wow. <laughs> okay, that's great. This was 18. Now it's 22. 22. All right, that's nice. Hey, uh, Yerlin, mm -hmm. you ain't getting off that easy. Gods be praised. I think I got... Oh, you won't buy those necklaces? Darn it, Yerlin. <sighs> mm-hmm. All right, well, we ought to find somebody else to sell the rest of this stuff to get us some more scratch. Best place to go, Ripton. Gotta love Ripton. I love the fact that they have, they're probably, like, I think the only place that have all of these vendors. You got 
the blacksmith the three that's outside so that's four then you got the guy that's on the side there whatever his name is so that's five then the lady who sells food that's six because you could sell some stuff to her oh then I'm certain there's a wizard inside of wherever the Jarl is, so that's, what, seven? Yeah. If you're looking for a handout, Fine you want jewelry. See for yourself. All right. There you go. I'll take that, too. All right. Safe travels, Landstrider. Yeah, I want everything. Working at the Rift and Fish. Excuse oh. me. Azura, save for yourself. In moments, or grow back that missing limb with my genuine Falma blood elixir. A missing limb. Okay, he can't afford all of that. And I still got scrolls to sell as well. All right. Keep your eyes to the road. Friends like, see for yourself. Now we're friends. When I first met you, you insulted me. I tell you, you, you can't trust people in Skyrim. All right. Come back when you're ready to spend more gold. Goodness knows I could use it. You, you are the harbinger of the companions. It is... Welcome to the Pond Frog. Come on in, take a look around. Well, trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Okay. Oh, I still got these staffs to sell too. Oh, yes. Okay, so let's get some stuff we need. To do some more soul gems. Um, you know what? I'll take these grand soul gems. Get those filled. Um, okay, and now some potions. I think I, I don't know. I never picked pocket it, so we'll see. I go for twenty percent more. The magicka light speed. Um, and I forgot to grab my backpack again from home. Oh, no, 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 no. Do you have a backpack on you? You do. Uh, I mean, I could just run back home and get one for free, you know? So, I don't see no. What do you got for sale? Oh, I got your stuff, right? Okay. Well, I sold the majority of everything, so we're good. And we still got, like, could sell these garnets and stuff. Not the rubies, though, or the sapphires. All right, thanks. Good day. Good day to you, too. Hey, Preston. All right, so we, we did pretty good. We Today was excellent. It really, really was. If you missed the madness yesterday or the day before, feel free to check out those streams. Oh, boy. Uh, it was really, uh, yeah, I don't even want to talk about that. But uh, I'm going to end the stream here. I hope everybody a have a great night, great morning, great day. I will catch you all God, uh, catch you all tomorrow, God willing. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe and click the notification bell so you get alert not notified when I start streaming. I normally stream every day and I play other games on the channel as well. So feel free to check out my other streams and other uh, videos. And um, what else? Um, what's this? got that um yeah we need some more money 
So I think tomorrow we're gonna do some exploring. If Find somewhere to Smith like a come see me again. Oh well, we still gotta turn in this stuff from All Fall Creek as well, so yeah. Hi right, guys, thanks for watching. I love you all. God be to you all. And I will see you tomorrow, God willing. Bye guys.